Welcome back. In this video, we shall learn how to use the dot length property in JavaScript. Let's say I have let's say I have a variable of name set to migrant solutions. And I want to know the number of characters in migrant solutions. Imagine a case where we have an essay of over 750 words and we need to know the number of letters in the whole essay so there is a function in javascript known as the dot length function that we can use to know the number of characters in a set of strings in a set of string and also the index position of each character in that set of string so using this name variable we can say name length and we set this to name dot length name dot length let's console dot log name length here now let's save to see what we have we have 17 this means there are 17 characters in migrant solutions and just to mention the space here is also a character so in case you want to count it manually don't forget the space before we jump into the next video let's talk about what we call bracket notation bracket notation in JavaScript is used to get the index position of a character in a set so let's say i want to know which character is occupying the 11th index position in migrant solutions i can do that using the bracket notation by just saying name length that's a quarter name and i'll use the square brackets and i'll say 11. and when i console.log name length it gives me u which means the letter u occupies the 11th index position in migrant solutions and just so you don't get confused in computer science counting starts from zero so m is actually going to be zero let's do that let's say zero you see zero gives us m this is because in computer science counting starts from zero not one don't forget to like don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to share